this is my review on Hancock. So, the movie's about this superhero who played by Will Smith called Hancock. And he doesn't know who, or where, really who, um, where he um, came from or who he was um, um, before this. So, he uh, just has been a superhero all the time. And, um, so, and he's also a, a, a drunk, and, uh, so he kind of, uh, and also kind of sucks at the superhero was and everyone pretty much hates him because he's an asshole. He doesn't really lose his temper when he, everyone calls him his a asshole because that really hurts his feelings. So, he meet, runs into this guy who he makes friends with, teaches him how to be a better person and a better hero. And he's a fan of Hancock and superheroes. And so he believed that Hancock can be an awesome superhero if he just wasn't such an asshole. And he calls him assholes with a face. He says this, he tells him this, and he says, I know you don't like that word, but you are. And he throws the kid up in the end and catch him because he called him an asshole. <laughs> he wasn't like one of the kid actually that. He just wanted to teach him a lesson. <laughs> uh, so he goes in prison and gets clean. And when he gets out of prison, he shaves and gets a tight suit. And the one what the cops are looking at again says, what are you guys, what is it? Oh, it's the suit. Yeah, the suit is a little tight. And he asks, what the, what's the, what's the problem, officer? Um, the, the, and give him the thing, and he hands off very well. With, and he doesn't come and, uh, he teaches him, how, and like, um, when he, uh, the guy, his friend taught him to, when you, when you, when you fly, when you land, don't come in too hot or too cold. And he actually becomes a changed man in prison. Uh, and the the public wants him to come back after serving time in jail. But they don't realize that they need him. And if the person says, yeah, good riddance if uh, handcuff. Then they realize that, that things have gotten worse since he's um, been out in prison. So they realize that they kind of need him. You know, he's... So, so, but he comes with he becomes a changed man uh, because it, there's another scene I like. He actually has a chance to escape because all he just does to fly over the fence to get the ball, and he says I'll get it, and he goes flies over jump over the flies over back in jail in the prison uh, over back in the fence, <laughs> and they're like, what the heck? <laughs> he can escape. <laughs> And he, so they realized that he can escape if he wanted to. <laughs> As, so he's the Seasley, but he's choosing to be on his best behavior. They really discovered he really wants to be a better person and a better hero. So they figured that out. And um, I'm not funny. He was too much saying now. If you don't do behave yourself, his ass, your head is going up his ass, and his head is going up your ass, and <laughs> and the, the, uh, all the people that he uh, put in the prison wants to be banned from it, and he says he says that thing, and they think he's full of shit, and what does he do? He actually does it. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, did you actually do that? It was, yes, I did. <laughs> um, so when he gets out of prison, he does, he, he, um, um, when he gets out of prison, um, I was starting his time in public wanting him back. Um, hang on, I got some water. I need to get some water.
So, anyway, he handles the situation very well. No one got hurt or anything. But the guy did lost his hand because he was holding a trigger. And he said the word asshole to the guy. He says, I really don't like that word. And he was like trying, the good thing he got was really trying to keep it together. So, he called an asshole again and says, um, that's not to say because he really doesn't like that word. So he called and asked him again, and he, you know, he had this like throws a disc at Shaman's uh, little, little plate thing, little piece of metal, and sharpens it and uh, uh, throws it at his hand, and uh, he lost his hand. Um, so, but it happens off screen, so, um, so, um, it's pretty interesting. Um, so after that, uh, he does more horror. He, um, he starts hanging out with uh, the the is um friend more and starts getting to know him a little better. That he doesn't know where he came from, and he is when he doesn't really age at all, and he's um. Uh, so he, um, also just, like, saw, like, a, um, something, saw it said Hancock, which was his, uh, ID that said Hancock. I believe it was an ID that said it. So that's where he got the name, uh, or he got it from a magazine. Anyway, uh, so because he didn't know what his actual name was, uh, uh, Hank. So after this, a little after a while, uh, him and his, his, he gets in a fight with his wife, and turns out she has superpowers like Hancock, and turns out she is Hancock's ex-wife, <laughs> and he calls her crazy, and uh, She's, uh, she says, man, I don't remember that you're who you are, but she was crazy because you're crazy. And she says, call me crazy one more time. And he says, cuckoo. And Terry seems goes crazy. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, uh, so that's a trigger for, like, like assholes are trigger for Hancock. Crazy tri trio for her, so <laughs> it's basically a match made in heaven uh, of, of for them. Uh, why did they separate? Well, it's because Hancock, the longer he's around her, the weaker he gets, and the more easy he's, a, he's the more easy he's to kill. And he doesn't find out until the end when he's in a hospital. So he has to get away far from her as possible. And she explains to him that's why we broke that, that's why we broke up because the longer you're around me, the weaker you get and the easier you are to kill. And this how we find this out that who put him to a hospital well, a bad guy. A human bad guy. He shot Hancock after him saving the day. So Hancock gets an hospital, he's very tragic. Actually, um so he just slowly gets his strength back as he goes out of the hospital and jumps out of the hospital and the next day you see that he um made a sign for that um that uh his friend wanted to be in the stars so to change the world and he goes off kicking ass and that is Hancock and there's a little something after the crest when the guy calls him asshole, and just, you know what's going to happen, something bad going to happen to that guy, that bad guy. <laughs> you know what's going to lose his temper for that. <laughs> this for that. <laughs> so um, that is Hancock. I'm sad that this movie never really got a sequel, but maybe that's for the best. Maybe it's better for to leave people wanting more than to being satisfied. I think. So thumbs up for Hancock.